Oh, the celebration trait uh, celebration chase is next then and this is another one of these races this week that's only got five runners in it there's been some real funny fields this week really small ones and the two huge ones the balance of the races has been a little skew with this week and this is two miles again grade two the top one is the extreme joshua sutherland catabatic for john morgan jackie rue for james follies you the one for john morgan and marmite rolling for derek hinton so, again, we've got a jerky video in mind, and away they go. And we've got two John Morgans and a Derek Hinton. I think they're going to go ridiculously fast in this. And probably set it up for Joshua Sutherland's horse. That would be my prediction if I had to have a bet on it. And they're coming down to the first of 11. Oh, and Derek Hinton's has gone already. Marmite rolling is rolling all over the floor. And out of the race and they are going really really quickly as well with catabatic in the lead and jackie rue second you the one is third not much to choose between those two in looks and the extreme is fourth and we shouldn't get any pull-ups in this with it only been two miles but i wouldn't bank on them being any more fours we're going at this pace and probably fancier Bet on a Morgan 1 2. Uh, Joshua Sutherland might have something to say about that. And with uh, the greatest of respect to Formula 1 Follis, he's probably looking at fourth place prize me in this. If he stays on his feet, and Catabatic is the leader. Four lengths clear. Our stable companion, you the one, and Jackie Roo. And then a good six or seven that's back to the extreme. And that shows you just how quick they're going because. That horse at the back is no sledge. And Catabatic will lead into the next. With a lead of about two or three lengths. Jackie Root doing his best to keep up with them at the moment. Oh, the leader went right through that. That's the problems with going a little bit quick there now. These back straight at Sand there, and you got those two there. We're going to ditch and a water jump. And then the railway fences. Over this ditch they go. And come down to the next. With Catabatic in the lead. Oh, Jackie ruin you the one. Oh, he won that one as well. These are the railways. And all oh, that time it was you the one that made the mistake. And if you make a mistake at these, you're really struggling. Because those three come up really quick. Now they're going to swing round towards the pond. Which will be the third last on the next circuit. And Catabatic is the leader from Jackie Rue second. Big gap then back to you the one and the extreme. And the Morgan pair may have been running pretty quickly. But they haven't been running all that I haven't been jumping all that well, and they haven't got to go around again at all. I think this is only a two mile race. This is the third last coming up, then it's the pond fence, and it's Catabatic going for home in the lead. Here comes the extreme. It looks like he's poised, ready to pounce at any point. You just never know how much these John Morgan horses have got left in the tank, though. And two to take up the straight. It's Catabatic from the extreme. Catabatic dropped it well, the extreme dropped it slowly. You the one trying to get back into it. Jackie Roo is well out of it. This is the final fence and over it they go. And Catabatic looks pretty comfortable in the lead. The, the extreme is trying to close. It's uphill for the last half furlong. And the extreme is getting closer. But Catabatic is being hard driven. Here comes the extreme. Catabatic, the extreme. Catabatic wins it. The extreme is second. Good more strides than either one. Then comes you the one. And Jackie Roo was last. So it was a win. For John Morgan, Catabatic takes it despite a couple of errors. Extreme, just like it need, looked like it needed a little bit further. In second for Joshua Sutherland, you the one for John Morgan was third. Jackie Rue for James Follis picked up fourth. And poor old Derek Hinton's Marmite Rowling was a faller at the very first fence. <laughs>